Hello everybody out here on YouTube. It is I here with Beautiful Beauty. Gonna be doing a product review for you beauties here today. Okay guys, let's get started. Okay, first off, this summer has been extremely eventful, but not only has it been eventful, I have bought a lot of products this summer and I've really discovered a lot of products that I love, a lot of products I'm glad I've tried, and a lot of products that I've been repurchasing. Okay, so this is my second jar that I've actually repurchased of this because I really liked it the first time around. Let me show you guys what this is. Little tiny print here. This is the brand, the SW Basics of Brooklyn. Focused, it says made simply with only three ingredients, fair trade shea butter, coconut oil, olive oil, uh, and they said it is organic. Okay, so this is the cream. And this comes in a, I believe, 0.7 ounce jar. <laughs> okay, okay, it is a small jar, I will tell you that, but it goes a long way, it really does. And also, this is supposed to be cruelty free and not Tesla animals, which I love that. Now, I have tried a few other of the SW Basics products before. You know, uh, some of them I liked, some of them, uh, you know, that's how it goes. You know what I mean? But I really love this stuff. I really do. It has like a balmy texture. Let's see if I can show you guys the texture of it. It has a really nice balmy texture. I know it's called cream, but honestly, it goes on more like a balm. And what I have been absolutely loving this for, I have been loving, loving this. I've been loving this as an under eye treatment, an under eye cream. Uh, typically, uh, normally, um, I was going to say rather traditional under eye creams don't really work for me. You know, it's just one of those things. My skin's very dry. My skin's very sensitive. And normally things that are geared for under the eye skin or under the eye area, they just don't work for me. My skin is just way too sensitive. My skin is honestly way too dry, and I love this balmy stuff. And I also like to use it on dry patches on my skin. I get, um, and I talk about this a lot on my channel, it's so funny because I get a little bit of a dry patch between my eyes at the top of, um, uh, top of bridge of my nose, between my eyes, kind of where the sunglasses rest, uh, between your eyes, basically. And I get a little bit of a reaction to plastic sunglasses, you know. It doesn't matter what brand, what designer, how expensive they are, how cheap they are, whatever. I get a little bit of a reaction from that plastic that's, uh, you know, made, uh, sunglasses are made with, rather. And I get a little dry patch between my eyes. So I've really been, I've really been slathering on, especially this summer, because, you know, I've been wearing sunglasses every single day, obviously. It's been a bright, hot summer, you guys. <laughs> But anyhow, I like to, you know, uh, moisturize that dry patch between my eyes. I've been loving this as an under eye cream. And I've been loving it as an eyebrow tamer because, you know, sometimes your eyebrow hairs are just, if you're me, I'm talking about myself, you know what I mean? My eyebrow hairs are kind of crazy sometimes and they'll go one direction and go another. But this really helps moisturize my eyebrow hairs. It helps them lay flat. And when I, I put it on at night before I go to bed, and then when I wake up in the morning, I wash my face, take my shower, get ready for work and do all that I do my eyebrows are going all the same direction my eyebrows are you know flat down in one direction like they should be and they're not sticking up or, or crazy or wonky or whatever you know what I mean so I am loving this stuff there's the ingredients you've got shea butter you've got a uh, coconut oil You've got olive oil and obviously organic. So very simplistic, very simple, real cut and dry on the ingredients. You know what's in the product. You know what you're getting. You're not getting any extra chemicals or ingredients or additives or agents. You know, no extra gunk in it. You know what I mean? So I am loving this stuff. Even though it's called cream, it has more of a balmy texture. It can be a little bit on the greasy side, but I tell you this, it does absorb very well into my skin. I'm actually applying it right now. <laughs> I really love it. This is my second jar. Oh, and I probably forgot to already mention, I bought this at Target. Uh, I will link it in the down bar below. Sometimes I forget to even tell you guys where I get things from, but I try to always, always, always link it in the down bar below, you know, unless I forget. <laughs> 
and you never know. You never know, guys. I might be forgetting. But anyhow, I bought it at Target. Absolutely love this stuff. If you have dry, sensitive skin, wonderful under eye cream, wonderful for dry patches, just wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. And I was going to throw in there, also been using this on scars as well. But it's been working beautifully. I really, really love this stuff. And the smell of it, oh, I love it. It smells, it, it smells a little bit like shea butter, but a little bit more medicinal than shea butter. But I love the smell. I really do. And I want to mention that I have, you know, scent sensitivity issues. I am sensitive to smells. This smell does not bother me the least. I have really bad sinus problems. No problem here with the smell on this. No problem at all. Really love it. Really great stuff. I definitely give it, you know, five or six thumbs up. You know what I mean? I love it. Okay, beauties. I hope you enjoyed. Take care now. Bye.